So greetings from Pennsylvania once again. We're back down here in Lancaster County here at Chickie's Rock. I have some friends that are going to be here at any moment. Actually, they were just here, but they had to quick go do something. Sorry about the traffic. We're right next to Route 441 there. All right, it's a little quieter now, but we're going to do a story here on the three witch sisters of Chickie's Rock. I got this story from a website called Uncharted Lancaster. I've mentioned it before in several videos, but uh, deals with the history here. And supposedly this place is kind of haunted or has a curse associated with it because there's three witch sisters. But as soon as my friends get here, we're going to search around. Um, there was a, back in the day, a trolley was built here to the site of Chickie's Rock. There's an overlook over here. And there was an amusement park associated with that and everything. That deals with our story. We're going to try and find any remnants of that around here and tell you a story at the same time and maybe i'll get them to help me tell the story too but anyway so i got my three companions with just made our making our way to the top from the parking lot we'll get away from the traffic noise but they're gonna they've agreed to help tell the story let's get away from this noise Towards the end of the 19th century, three sisters lived in a small house atop Chickie's Hill in an area at the time referred to as The Rock. It was a common belief by many in town that these women's, women were practitioners of the black arts. The sisters, witches or not, were content to be left alone away from the progress of a rapidly modernizing world. Unfortunately, progress and greed felt differently. Most trolley companies of that area had one or more amusement parks along their routes to help enhance summer revenues and provide a place for weekend outings. So it made sense that Columbia and Donegal Electric Railway would want one too. You know, as the story mentioned, three witch sisters. I'm not saying anything, but look, one, two, three. <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, they're laughing too. Yeah, so the main trail that you take to Chickie's Rock is the is the old trolley road that they built here. <laughs> yes, yeah, so as the story goes, like she said, there's three sisters that lived up here, and uh, they were going to build a trolley to the lookout, and they were going to put an amusement park up here too, and the sisters were in the way. So, yes, yeah, so the main trail of Chickie's Rock is down below there, but you can see how there's areas up here that are completely flat. Up here is where the amusement park was. Up here, probably over that way too, the whole top of this mountain is kind of flat. Not sure exactly where the sisters lived, but probably more up on the hill up there. I don't know if there's any remains of the amusement park up here or not either, but we'll, we'll have a look around. Oh, there's tons of mushrooms here. Oh, a ton of them. All the way over there. Little baby ones too. The was to build tracks along the side of the ridge from Columbia with a completion date of 1893. The railway would climb 1,900 feet on a 6% grade, running on the west side of Chickie's Hill Road and then curving sharply west to reach Chickie's Park. It was here at the amusement park, would be built on the west end of the ridge atop Chickie's Rock, overlooking the Susquehanna. The only problem was the home occupied by the three sisters sat squarely in the middle of the proposed site. Yeah, someone decorated a tree up here. Got a few Christmas bell uh, ornaments on it. But anyway, holly tree. All right, we're gonna keep making our way. You can see the main trail down there to Chickie's Rock, but we're gonna make our way this way. Head up to the hill up there. Yeah, so we're, we're on the top of this hill. You see it's all just completely flat up here on this hill. So that's not normal. So I, I just don't know if there's anything actually left up here. I doubt it, but this also knows where this, according to the story, the sisters lived up here. Their house was up here somewhere. Maybe a bit closer to the actual overlook. I've actually never been up here. I've always, every time I come to Chickie's Rock, I always take the main trail over. The C&D began purchasing all the needed parcels of land. Most were eager to sell, except for the sisters. The C&D made several offers, 
each was more generous than the one before, but the sisters refused every single time. They would never give up their ancestral <gasps> oh home. That's crazy. So you got a nice view of the, it's a Susquehanna out there. <laughs> What happened? You want to tell the story? What happened oh, this, to my first stick? Oh, the last stick. time we came here. Well, yeah, feel free. Go ahead. That was years ago, though. No, but what happened? Oh, the yeah, stick. What, what was it? What did you do? To, what did you do with my stick? The perfect stick I ever owned in my entire I, life. You had it sitting what on the you? overlook. No, and, uh, I didn't have it sitting. I had a hand on that thing. I think it was just sitting. Oh there. no, I'm not that silly. Well, I uh, keep good watch over my stick. And I, what I, happened, I what tossed, happened to the stick? I tossed, tossed. A, I tossed a stick I over the overlook. I think there was a bit more force than I that. Tossed I tossed a stick over, like a the, over the overlook. Chuck. And it, uh, Shoved was with the, all mighty force. That was like, that was like 20 years ago. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> but I've apologized thoroughly for that incident, so. No, you don't. You bring it up and then you laugh like you are right now. <laughs> and twist it's, my story. Uh, so what's this? The orange. The orange? Oh, that's more fungus, yeah. The tears it's of just... the tree that remember its brothers. <laughs> I, forget, I forget what it's called, though. <laughs> so. All right, back to our three witches story. <laughs> Railway officials discussed building the park around the sisters, but given the controversy of them being witches, the plan was scrapped. Left with no alternative, the trolley company convinced local officials to grant them the land through eminent domain. Still refusing to leave, but left with no other choices, the sisters turned to the black arts for revenge. Down with eminent! Yeah, so the, the old ladies had, they had some books that were used, um, familiar with the whole Pennsylvania Dutch culture. They had these, something called powwow, which is kind of like a combination of magic and traditional beliefs. They had several books that they used that had like curses and stuff in it, and the witches, the supposed witches use those books to curse the trolley line, as the story goes. And we may have found something up here, probably not amusement park related, but it looks like a, a Bigfoot structure. <laughs> it's like someone made a teepee up here. Or maybe, or maybe, just maybe, this is all that remains of the house of the three witch sisters. Oh, come on, we would have been... Something Build something better. <laughs> yeah. Architecturally, it needs work. Architecturally, I don't know. The kettle goes right in the middle. And the then kettle? Did you say down. the kettle? <laughs> then it all burns down. The kettle goes right in the Cauldron. middle. Cauldron. Cauldron. Middle. Spirals to the sky. All right, so we'll say goodbye to our little witch house here. Do you guys know Bigfoot? Because that looks like a Bigfoot Achoo! house. I'm telling you, the, you the, the protection <laughs> spell. <laughs> the protection spell. <laughs> Those right. beetles were trained. <laughs> oh, these ones, the more. Yes. So, this is, so that's like ancient writing from a spell or something. Correct. The oh, beetles okay. have been trained. <laughs> okay. So beware. So I think this is the end of the, the hilltop area here, so if the story is true and the sisters did live up here, it's probably up here somewhere. Because once you can see how flat it is, but this is probably where the amusement park was too. It's where the trolley line is right down below us and it'll come around a little bit and Chickie's Rock Overlook is just right down there. It looks like there's another uh, structure over here too. Is this man? Don't come any closer. <laughs> Don't come any closer. Throw you on our barn fire. This is the sacrificial. Oh. <coughs> the sacrificial. <laughs> yeah, it does look like someone piled it there. Someone. Uh, oh, someone. <laughs> oh. I'm just gonna back up. Yeah, you made you know. a choice. <laughs> that works. Yeah. We found a little evil symbol on the tree here. And what's it supposed to do? If we don't like you, it turns to a frown. Oh, but look, it stays, it stays it's smiling. Broken. It's, it's broken. broken. Oh, wow. That kind of We hurts. haven't <laughs> been here in a while. <laughs> and here's the, here's the trail goes deeply down. This is the bloodlet. <laughs> oh, really? Wow. This is the bloodlet. Yeah. A series of costly mishaps plagued the company concerning both the construction 
and operation of the park. Some believe the curse caused a tragic August 9th, 1896 trolley accident that killed six and injured another 68 when a deadly swarm of potato bugs <laughs> descended on the tracks. Down the bloodlet, ladies, down the bloodlet. Oh, that's pretty steep. All right, very well. So I'm pretty sure like it's up here. The amusement park was up here somewhere, I think, but. You guys aren't allowed to fall because if you fall, I don't want to fall. You guys I'm just, I'm, 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 I'm crouching. Just crawling. Up here is about the only historical piece we'll see up here. This is the actual section of the trolley line. See where the rails were there. So, yeah, so this may have been, we were talking about, it might have been like a, a turntable, something like that to turn the trolley around. Because when it would have come up here, it would have needed to turn around to go back. But we're going to take a quick pick, uh, stop to overlook up here. Since we're here and after this we're gonna keep on exploring um, we're gonna be playing laser tag with a bunch of friends later today so we got we got like an hour of exploring yet to do so I think we might go check out some other places here at Chickie's Rock some places that we've I, I've been to before in videos but we're gonna go do a little exploring maybe talk a little more about the witch sisters but that is the story of them like I got this story from that site called Uncharted Lancaster whether the story's true or not, you know, it's one of those things. But it does make for a good uh, legend of this area. The three witch sisters of Chickie's Rock. Maybe we'll see more evidence of them later today. Oh. What does it say? $5,000 fine. Oh, you're going back to that, that stick thing again. Do not throw any objects. That was it. can cause death. That wasn't here. And serious injury and mental trauma. That wasn't to say children. <laughs> That wasn't here when I... penalties? Oh, boy. Report mom. I don't think that sign was here. Report criminal activity. Yeah, because we're expecting you. I forget which... I think it was that overlook down there that I threw the stick off of. I don't even want to move it. the rocky one. Yeah. Move dog I just actually don't here today. What a cloudy view today. But the sisters did live up here, they got a good view. Always cool to come up here. So thanks for coming along with me and my friends on this little adventure. Um, they want to kind of planned to do something today before we went out with some other friends to play laser tag or at the laser dome you know what that is here in Lancaster County so we decided to go down to Chickie's Rock and do the story on the witch sisters uh, my one friend Dana had sent me that article uh, about a week or so ago on, on the witch sisters she knows I like stories like that in the local area so that was, that was fun going up there with them and looking around I'd been up been to some places up there we had I had never been before so that was kind of fun just hiking around a little bit there. So anyway, thanks for watching and hopefully we'll see you on the next one.